Hi, my name is Wan Amsha Irfan and I'm from BK, 6BK1 and I'm going to talk about water pollution. Water pollution is very serious environment is environmental issue that we are fresh, facing right now. Water get polluted when the physical, bi physical biology and chemical properties deteriorated due to human activities further. Water pollution is responsible for impacting the life of human and animal as well. It is extremely hazardous to the environment and must be cured right now, right away. You might think that the water you drink really is clean, but it contains pollution. Thus, we need to adopt measures that will help prevent water pollution on a global level for a healthier lifetime. As mentioned above, water pollution is a significant threat to the ecosystem and the subsistence of life. The major cost responsible for water pollution is definitely the industries that, that dump waste into water bodies. They, don't, they do not properly treat the waste and directly dump the harmful toxin in the water. Thus, it hampers the quality aquatic life badly. The aquatic species consume the harmful chemical which is present in the water and die because of it. Consequently, it is a huge threat to the ecosystem, whether on land or water. Moreover, the chemical, this chemical also reduces the oxygen content in the water bodies. Further, we see that the brutal use of the fertilizer and fertilizers that are done in the aquatic sector polluted the water bodies greatly. When they discharge, when they discharge, discharge in a not a regulated and sanitation in a proper is not proper, it contributes the water pollution. Moreover, the humans and animals who consume this water from the populated water bodies have a negative impact on your health. Besides, these polluted water bodies have become home to bacteria and germs. Thus, they, they, cause, they cause waterborne disease and epidemics that like diarrhea, cholera, and more. Similarly, they also contaminate contaminates underground water when it seeps through the soil. Thus, we need to prevent water pollution by adopting proper waste management policies. A single organization, government or individual individual won't be able to accomplish this, start, this task. We need to do it collectively. We can all collectively control water pollution to a large extent. We need to realize the that pollution's solution is dilution. Dilution. There are several methods that there are several methods through which one can control water pollution. That begin with the sewage pollution that contain of lot of toxic material. So they must be chemically treated in order to make them less toxic. A factor which contributes to this pollution is organic insecticides. We we can reduce it by using less stable chemical in their manufacturing process. Further, there must be there must be regulation of industries as they should be allowed to dump waste water into water bodies. Similarly, there must be proper sewage treatment plan in every city. This this will allow using the same water in factor factories and also irrigation moreover this water can also serve as a great fertilizer in addition we must also adopt measures to reduce the occurrence of oil pill on an individual level we can also do our bit to prevent water pollution begin by saying no to plastic as it remains in our ocean for thousands of years Reuse the item so there is less water production. Try, elim try eliminating the use of detergent and bleaches, and if necessary, use environment friendly detergent.
all in all it is very essential for all to start practicing a lifestyle which does not contribute water pollution we need we life without it we need water to survive and we won't be life without it thus thus that make to world better to make the world better a better place for upcoming generation we must start working from now thank you that's all from me